Hello everyone and welcome back to some more behind the scenes British Esports Student Champs uh, interviews. We're here with the victors of the Valorant uh, competition that we have over this weekend. Do you want to just introduce yourself and tell us uh, who you are and what you play for? Uh, hi, I'm Seb. I play for the NSCG Tigers and I'm the team captain. Perfect. So how do you feel about your performance today? Obviously quite a dominating win. Uh, yeah, honestly, we feel really great about it. The Ascent game, uh, the first game was, you know, obviously we were doing really good at the start. We slowed the pace down a little towards the end. That was a bit stressful. But in the end, we managed to bring it together to a close and kept on composure throughout yeah, the entire thing. It was a really good performance, really enjoyable to see. So what has your experience been like with Student Champs as a whole over the course of this season? I mean, uh, it's been pretty rough on us specifically in NSCG just because we've had a few mixed rounds with uh, lesson schedules and such. So it's, uh, but overall with the BEA himself and student champs, there hasn't been you know too many problems organizing any events or anything like that. Mm -hmm. Things run pretty smoothly week from week. Lovely, that's all right to hear. Um, what has been the highlight so far then for champs apart from the finals? <coughs> Uh, the highlight, well, it must be the winter win, to be honest. Yeah. That's definitely the highlight for us. Uh, we had, you know, a very dominant run throughout the entire course of it. And then the winter win was a very close game, you know, really brought it to the very last round, very last match. And we brought it together in the end and played a great game. Lovely. And what's next then for the, the Tigers? What, what are you guys going on to do after this? Are, are you sticking around as a team or will some of you be moving on? Uh, well, some of us will be moving on. The biggest loss definitely for us will be uh, Heesh, oh, our okay. end game leader. He's uh, moving on to, you know, bigger and better things because he is a great player. So he's moving up. So we won't be seeing him next year. But apart from that, we're not really sure what's going to happen with the team. If we're going to, some of us might stick around, some of us might move on. We'll, we'll see next year. Excellent. Hopefully for the best then. Thank you everyone at home for tuning in and watching. If you'd like to see more British Esports content, don't forget to follow the channel, follow all our socials, subscribe, everything like that. Make sure you tune in for the rest of the interviews as well. Make sure you check those out. Uh, thanks again for stopping by and we'll see you next time.